This is another episode, a uh, cheesy episode of Birth of the Builder. This time we're going to refinish or refurbish uh, this old wheelbarrow that was actually used as part of my family's construction company in Scottsdale. I'm trying to remember when it was. I worked there in the summers in high school, so it was in the early 1980s. This was on the construction site at a uh, development called Sandpiper in McCormick Ranch. So I'm gonna, uh, I got new posts and new hardware, bolts and nuts, and uh, stay tuned for the next part when this is all brand new. We're not gonna paint it though, because Angie thinks, my wife thinks that it's uh, preserved part of history to keep it just like it is. My wife and I have a saying that if she asks me to do something, I will get it done. She doesn't have to remind me every six months. <laughs> well, I'm glad to tell you, this didn't take six months to finish the project. It took almost six months to finish the video. So anyway, you can see we finished all the new hardware has been put in place. posts or whatever these pieces are called, the main um, supports uh, from Home Depot, but I flipped them the wrong way. They should be the other way. They're very close in dimension both ways, but they should be um, rotated, I guess, 45 degrees or 90 degrees. Maybe that's why I became a lawyer, but that's a story for another day. Back to the video. These pieces, be very careful when you take apart the wheelbarrow. You cannot buy these pieces. You'll have to custom cut them to fit, and they'll need to be cut at the correct, correct angle so that the wheelbarrow still lays at the correct angle. And then finally, I have to also cut these new pieces here. So I hope the video was helpful, and until next time, have a good one.